Good morning to my babies. Welcome back to my channel. And I'm just Nene and I'm gonna clip this TV down because I'm watching some old show. But I am on my way to the store. Happy 4th of July. And guess what? I'm not gonna grill outside, but y'all know what I'm grilling. And my foodie. So I'll be back with you guys. I'll probably show you on my adventure what I pick up at the store. Alright? Okay, guys, so I'm walking out to the house on this 4th of July. Be back, Ty Ty. I'll be back, Brittany. I'm telling them I'll be back. Okay, I don't know who this is. Truck is. Brittany! 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 She in here knocked the hell out of sleep. I'm trying to go to the store, y'all, and she's sleep. It's like 10 o'clock. She gotta be at work at 2. Brittany, baby. Mm -hmm. I can't go anywhere because you're blocking me. And these people need to move their truck. And so easy. She cut the grass yesterday. But um, I'm going to have to come out here and do some things. I was fussing because uh, my neighbors got a habit of their guest parking and it be in my yard and we have a single driveway and I'm going to see if I can talk. My landlord is going to come or oh, he sent somebody to come and look at the, uh, the raising of the driveway and these two trees that they're going to cut and trim down because they have overgrown really bad and uh i'm gonna see if he can just pour a little side spot if they redo the driveway pour a little side spot to widen it so she can park not in the street it's 70 what, 75 degrees right now so i'm on my way to Walmart. I'm not doing too many 4th of July activities. Um, I'm just not really in the 4th of July mood. I'm going to be honest with you guys. I'm looking at this country totally different um, with all that has happened since the clock struck January 1st, 2020. Um, and 4th of July used to be one of my favorite holidays, but now I, I've, I guess I've had a, I'm woke, I have a awakening experience. I don't mind telling people happy 4th of July, but it's just a little different for me this year. It don't have the same meaning. Um, so I'm just going to the store. I know I already got some corn. So I'm going to take the corn. I'm doing the, food, the ninja food thing today. I'm not going out on my patio cooking. I'm not doing all that. I'm keeping it inside and everything. That's what I'm going to do. And I'm going to edit some vlogs and get some stuff posted up. And hopefully this will be posted up today once I do what I do. 
then you'll see some other footage. If not, it'll be posted tomorrow. Um, the day after the floor. Oh, what was I going to say? Thank you guys for watching the previous video that I did about do you have your passport. That's a very important thing because me and one of my girlfriends had a discussion about do you have your passport. And um, it was pretty it was pretty interesting because she was saying she was, you know, dating a guy and they got ready. Why do I have this in my ear? I have no idea. And they got ready to, uh, they were going to plan a trip out, you know. So she asked him, she said, babe, you got your passport? And he said, uh, no, but I'll apply for it and I'll get it. So they went through the process to get it and everything and then came back. He couldn't get his passport. And it wasn't that he had a felony. Guess what it was? He owed in the rear's child support. So she said, baby, if it's, you know, why don't you just see, you know, how much you owe. Now, this man knew how much he owed in that back child support, y'all. But when this chick told me that he was 100, 100K, 100,000 in the rear, I said, well, damn, he didn't pay no child support at all since them babies was being born. And she said, yeah, and she said, we used not together. She said, because I can't plan a future with somebody that owes $100,000 in back child support. And uh, he, he'll never pay that off. She said, that's like owing an, on an expensive car or something. She said, and he paying only the bare minimum that he has to pay. Now this person know they ran the stop. They did not even stop. They ran the stop. That's why I said, let me go on. It's 10, 10, 16. I said, let me go on and go up to this store and get back. Because, you know, my little notes is that you folks are uh, doing what they want to do. And I ain't trying to, I'm not, I ain't trying to do I'm trying to get basic stuff that I need and get the hell on. That's what I'm trying to do. Next weekend, we probably do some adventures. As they call it. But like I was saying, she said it just made me realize, you know, you can't get a passport. I want to travel the world. I want to see the world. And I want a person to be able to do it with me. And you can't do it with me because you can't get a passport because you owe 100K in child support. Back in the rear. So, they went on and did their own little thing with their own little ways. But, yeah. Today is going to be a little simple, 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 simple vlog. And I'm going to keep y'all posted on different things. So, I get back with you guys in just a moment.
got the French toast on the griddle. Okay, so I got the last two pancakes cooking. Yeah. And there's my plate. And that's what's left. The girls came in and get scooped up. So. It's done. Nobody tell you that they love you. Me, I'm just me, me. I am telling you I love you and. Mm -hmm.